Hey guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 3 Module 1 Lesson 12 homework. So let's get started. Number 1. 10 people wait in line for the roller coaster. 2 people sit in each car. Circle to find the total number of cars needed. Alright, so there's 2 people in each car, which means um, only 2 can fit each car. So now we're circling to find how many groups, how many cars are needed. So let's see. 1, 2... That's one group. One, two, one group. Two, two, and two. So 10 divided by two, we have one, two, three, four, five. So we have five groups, which means there are five cars needed. Number two, Mr. Ramirez divides 12 frogs equally into six groups for students to study. Draw frogs to find the num number in each group. Label known and unknown information on the tape diagram to help you solve. So what do we know? So in total, there's 12 frogs and there's six groups. But right now we're trying to find out how many frogs in each group. So let's see, we, can, we know there's 12, so we can just keep drawing frogs until we reach 12. And let's just draw circles to represent frogs. So one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Alright, so we did six um we did six groups and twelve frogs, so that gives us two in each group. So that means six times two is twelve, and twelve divided by six is two, which means there are two frogs in each group. Number three, match. So ten divided by two. So um, basically the easiest way to do this is to just memorize this, but, um, one way we can do is we can just keep count by two. So two, four, six, eight, ten. So that'd be five. So this would match. And then six and divide two. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. So that'd be eight. And eighteen would be two, four, six, eight, ten. 12, 14, 16, 18. So that would be 9. And then 14 divided by 2, that would be 7. Alright, next page. Alright, so now it says Betsy pours 16 cups of water to equally fill two bottles. How many cups of water are in each bottle? Label the tape diagram to represent the problem, including the unknown. So let's start. What do we know so far? So in total, she pours 16 cups to fill two bottles. So now we have to find out how many cups in each bottle. So one way we can do this is to keep on drawing until we reach 16. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So this shows that there are eight cups in each bottle, which means 16 divided by two is eight. So there are eight cups in each, um, of water in each bottle. Number five, an earthworm tunnels two centimeters into the ground each day. The earthworm tunnels at about the same pace every day. How many days will it take the earthworm to tunnel 14 centimeters? All right, so let's start with the tape diagram. So let's see, what do we know so far? So we know that the earthworm, we can just draw like that, tunnels two a day. That's two centimeters a day. So, and um, we wanna find out how many days will it take till he tunnels um, a total of 14 centimeters. So we're trying to find out days. So when we, when we can do this is just keep on drawing two until we count to 14. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Or we don't even have to draw it like that, I guess. Just do it. Let's actually look that up. 
14. So this takes us one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that means 14 divided by two equals seven. So that means it will take the earthworm seven days. It will take the earthworm seven days to tunnel 14 centimeters. Number six says Sebastian and Tesson, Tashan go to the movies. The tickets cost $16 in total. The boys share the cost equally. How much does Tashan, Tashan I'm not sure, Tashan play, pay? All right, so let's see, what do we know? Let's start by drawing a tape diagram. So there's, let's separate it in half because there's Sebastian and Tashan. So what do we know so far? We know the tickets all together cost $16. And there's two boys. So they're sharing the cost in half. So now I have to find out how much are they paying each. So let's keep on drawing dots until we reach 16. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. So that would be 8, which means 16 divided by 2 boys is 8, which means each of the boys are sharing, um, are paying $8. So that means that Sean pays $8. And as does Sebastian, since they're sharing the cost um, equally. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye!